Welcome in Bordeaux, everybody. I'm Martina Torrini, product manager for Lagoon. I'm very excited to present you today the Lagoon 55, the new born in the Lagoon range. Let's start this visit on board with an overview of the exterior design and of the innovation of this new model. This new Lagoon 55 reveals a careful created exterior design, a perfect balance in between the Lagoon DNA and innovation. All around, a deck book work lent the boat an elegant and refined profile, offering at the same time a protected promenade around the deck. The exterior design of the coach roof participates in the overall flowing experience. It is animated by an integrated handrail, which contributes to slimming down the overall impression of height in the coach roof, as well as featuring the now identifiable Lagoon graphic signature, the roof in perceived levitation. The adventure on the Lagoon 55 starts with this access on board. A new design and a new location for the stairs allowed an incredible space on board for the transoms. The two transom aft, now keep completely clear, are free to become a real living area. Equipped with the grill plancha, they give you access and an outside galley just behind your cockpit. And thanks to a retractable seat, you can enjoy reading a book or just looking at people swimming. The surfaces of the transom is enlarged when the platform is down. The hydraulic platform allows you a great circulation in between port and starboard. Thanks to this innovative access on board, the cockpit features a surfaces of 25 square meters. This new design enlarges the spaces on board and clearly separates the cockpit from the surface of the transom defining two separate areas and clearly giving a sensation of safety and comfort on the sail. Thanks to a structural fit, making the aft beam completely disappear, the rear cockpit stands out as a real terrace on the water. Two large lounging areas at the back of the cockpit invite clients to relax, facing the sea at anchor and staring at the wakes while on the sail. Designed as an integrated furniture unit, the bar offers a sink, multiple storages, nice amenities such as cup holders and wooden cutting board. Fridge and ice maker complete the offer as an option. A large stick table designed for 12 guests provided an incredible standard setting capacity. A double foldable stick tables as an option provide better circulation and flexibility for different use or dining area. An extra large cockpit, but also extra storages. In the center of the nacelle, two large storage forward for the life raft and three more storages underneath the floor to store all you need on board. Underneath the seats, two large storages complete the wall volume you can get access on board. Accessible from port, the flybridge features three amazing areas. The maneuvering in the front, a large dining area to enjoy life at the top and two relaxing area, one aft and one forward. Helm station is located forward. Fully equipped with electronics, it features practical storages and cup holders. A large bolster helm seat allows friends to be sitting next to the captain. On this boat, as on the other lagoon of the range, the mast is moved back. In line with the impressive VPLP design racing result, is providing a very high aspect ratio. Main sail and jib give us a total sail area of 186 square meters that jumps up to 266 as we switch to the cut zero. Definitely in line with uh, a reactive and seaworthiness sailing yacht. All winches are located in the front, next to the mast and to the helm station. Thanks to the Harken Flatwinder, all maneuvers come back to the helm and make life easier for handling the boat alone or short-handed. Aft, a large sunbathing area equipped with lift-up lamps and cup holders. The perfect location to enjoy reading a book while sailing. Underneath the sunbathing area, two large storages and a third one next to the dining area. Forward, a second sunbathing area offers clients a new location to enjoy sun at mooring. The outdoor flybridge bar is on starboard and is fully equipped with refrigerator, sink, storages and some other amenities such as cap holders, wooden cutting board and a push-up lamp. 
The Flybridge features a GRPB Mini as an option with two integrated windows, one in the center and one forward, to always keep an eye on your seats. As an asset for a smaller crew, an additional access on starboard is available as an option. Located just behind the helm seat, it ensures a more direct access to the foredeck while anchoring with a short-handed crew. Fully integrated in the design of the boat since the beginning, the forward area is a cozy cocoon. It features lounging and seating areas. No more boundaries between inside and outside. A fully retractable windows make the connection between the forward cockpit and the saloon. A great way to connect different moments of life on board and a guarantee for good ventilation. The forward cockpit features a cozy protected areas with sofa and loungers. A smart modular system in the front with two additional seats and a folding tick table guarantees a multiple configuration option for this area and easy access to windless and to two large storage lockers at the front of the cockpit. Multiple sun protection solution suit all weather situation and your desire. A fabric cockpit enclosures allow you to create a real private cocoon. A large sun awning with carbon pillars create a great solar protection and a nice shady area to enjoy some wonderful time at Anchor. Welcome to the saloon. 27 square meters of living space, combining a lounging dining area, a fully equipped galley, a bar and a chart table. Fully connected with the outside, thanks to the large sliding window with the rear cockpit, sliding forward windows, front cockpit, and two outstanding overhead windows that brings the outside in and enlarge the sensation of the volume, the feeling of luminosity and the ventilation on board. Thanks to the modular table, the saloon can be adapted to suit your desire. Low table to chill and watch TV, or high table to dine with family and friends. The lounging area is completed at the back by a large amount of storage and niches in order that you have all you need at your fingertips. The TV comes out from the ceiling with an electric lift, up and down, and a manual movement to pull it on port or starboard. A bar strategically positioned in the saloon, next to the galley and close to the dinette, so that the ritual of the aperitivo is friendly and functional. The large chart table on port is ideally located. It has a lot of storages, underneath the top and next to the side. All the electronics are fully accessible. The galley is located between the aft cockpit and the dinette, perfect for preparing and serving in both areas and encourage conviviality across all spaces, whether the guests are indoor or outdoor. A small but significant feature is the series of modular storage units in stainless steel that are here along the galley countertop a touch of a larger yacht in this stylish interior. The galley features all the standard equipment like home, a stove, an oven, a microwave, a fridge and a large amount of storage in the upper lockers on both sides. To complete the volume available on board, underneath the floor, four large storages to store all you need. Each time that we could, we have switched smart drawers to easy access of all the storages even underneath the sofa. Aboard this Lagoon 55, a secondary galley area stands out on port. The secondary galley on port is a real pantry and a laundry room. It's an asset for long cruising. The pantry features a full high fridge and freezer and a large amount of storage. It can be equipped with a washing machine and a dryer and become at the same time a really separate laundry room. It is definitely a great offer that completes the already large galley in the saloon. One major innovation on board this Lagoon 55 in the saloon is the integration of the overhead windows in the coach roof. This is a promise of an exceptional luminosity in the saloon and it definitely offers a new view of the outside. The Aftport VIP cabin. A large cabin that features a lot in common with the older cabin. A larger bed, numerous storage and a large desk area aft. Three large wardrobe and drawers underneath the bed plus storages outboard complete the whole volume that this cabin is offering in terms of storage. A lot of luminosity is coming inside this cabin from the outside windows and from the aft windows. A separate larger head completes the benefits of this cabin and raises the level of comfort of this Lagoon 55.
The forward port cabin features nice volumes. Thanks to the reduced height of the bed, it is ideally positioned to enjoy the view of the outside. A lot of luminosity coming in thanks to the exterior windows, dedicated wardrobe aft, large doors underneath the bed. Forward the ensuite head with all the same details with a countertop in Corian and the floor in the shower in Corian. The shower has a large volume, the whole area is fully ventilated with the deck hatch and many smart storages complete the scene. The forward starboard cabin, a symmetrical layout of the port one. A little smaller volume, but always a nice wardrobe at the back and storage is outboard, smart drawer underneath the bed. A volume and refined atmosphere with great attention to detail, the Nauta design signature is clear in this owner cabin. With a private access from the saloon, this suite features an original layout with an opening dressing room and a bathroom area close to the night and the living area they aft. The sofa and the double bookshelf outboard invite you to stretch out and comfortably read a book. The large desk aft, together with the numerous storage, set the scene for a perfect home office while cruising. A large bed, 1 meter 70 wide, larger than all the other cabins on board. Real storage outboard, drawers on both sides of the bed. As an option, a sliding door comes here next to the sofa to separate the two different areas. The large open bathroom shows up Korean detail for the sink and for the floor of the shower. The large shower is fully open to the sea with the outboard windows and a dedicated edge on the deck. Forward, the separate toilet complete the offer of these large open heads in the owner suite. We are now at the end of this walkthrough on the Lagoon 55, the new entry in the Lagoon range. I hope you did enjoy the tour. I just summarized with a few words the innovation on this new lagoon. The innovative access on board that give us the sensation of a real extra large cockpit and a terrace on the water. The two overhead windows that bring the outside in. And this beautiful forward cockpit where you can really enjoy time with your friends at moorings. I hope to see you soon and I hope you enjoy this tour on board with me.